Let's talk about how you can manifest anything you want into your life. Anything. Did you hear me say anything? Anything you want. This is the only video you need to watch to manifest anything you want, anything that you desire, anything you have been dreaming of. This is the only video that you need. I can guarantee you, if you watch this video until the end and listen carefully and apply all of these things into your life, you will be manifesting your dreams in no time. I know manifesting can be confusing sometimes. So you know what, in this video, I'm gonna make it more practical for you guys by sharing some of the tips and tools that I have been using that help me manifest so many things in my life. Now, everything I'm about to say in this video is coming from all the practice I've had over the years and research I have done. Cause I don't want y'all to be stuck manifesting the same thing over and over again. Instead, I want you guys to dream big and achieve anything you want. So get a pen and paper, sit down, listen carefully and manifest your dream life and thank me later. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. By the way, you guys, this video is brought to you by my favorite manifestation app, Manifesti, which you can obviously find on the app store and I will talk about the app a little bit later. Number one, get super clear about what you want to manifest. Now you have to allow yourself to dream big, but you gotta know what you want. Now most people think that they know what they want, but in reality, they have no idea what they want. Because if you ask them, they're gonna be like, I want more money. Uh-uh, that's not clear. What do you really want? You have to be crystal clear on what you want. Like if someone woke you up in the middle of the night and yelled, what do you want? You should instantly open your eyes and know what you're manifesting. Now that my friends is real clarity. So really clarify your vision and obviously put in some effort, make sure to enjoy the process and practice limitless thinking. Because trust me when I say this, anything is possible. When you are clear about what you want, you will be able to manifest anything. For example, you want to manifest a car. What kind of car? What color is the car? What does the interior look like? How does it feel to drive this car? You have to be super clear on what you want because if you're just trying to manifest a car, you could manifest a broken car. But at the end of the day, you ask the universe for a car, so you got a broken car. You have to be super freaking clear. The color, how it feels, the interior, how the seats feel like, does it feel like to drive this car? What is the model of this car? Every single thing. Now here's a great tip for you guys. Now for this, vision boards are great. But you know what's better? Vision board movies. Let me tell you why manifestation movies work way better. You can add music and affirmations to your images, which can really help trigger those positive emotions, which is what it is all about, you know? Now, when you're looking at a static vision board, it is kind of difficult to actually change your vibration. But movies, on the other hand, are immersive. It can really help you shift your state and your point of attraction. I have changed my vision boards to vision board movies, and I watch them time to time, and trust me, it has helped me manifest things way quicker, faster, and way more easily. Number two, I've said this before and I'll say it again. Whether you're manifesting or not, keep your goals and dreams to yourself so that you don't invite any kind of criticism or negative emotions. Now, if you really wanna share, you could share your goals with someone who you know is going to be 100% supportive and encouraging. And when you think or speak of your desires, Always speak in the present language as if it has already happened. Just remember, it only has to make sense to you. So do not invite other people's lack of mindset. Instead, let these ideas grow in your mind like a seed. Honestly, this is such a game changer. Ever since I stopped telling other people whatever I'm trying to achieve, my goals, my dreams, I have been able to manifest things way faster and way more like positively into my life. Because whenever I would say something, for example, if I told my friend, who was not a very supportive person, not a very encouraging person, not a very positive person, she would most definitely make fun of me. But ever since I stopped doing that, I have been able to manifest things like, like this, because you know why? Because I am not inviting other people's criticism or negative emotions into my energy, you know? Number three, remind yourself often through auto-suggestion. Now, if you want fire positive thoughts throughout the day to stay in vibrational harmony with your manifestations, but of course, without being obsessive or too attached. Walk and talk like you already have it. Like you already have that dream job. You already have your, you know, crush. You already got your ex back. You already have a million dollars in your bank account. You already got that modeling contract, whatever it is. Walk 
and talk as if you already have it, as if you have already achieved this goal. Catch yourself often and redirect your mind, your feelings, and your actions to stay in alignment with your future self. You could do this by hanging post notes on your door, your mirror, or set a screensaver that goes off with an affirmation whenever your computer turns off. Or you could use your phone to keep yourself on track because I know most of y'all are on your phones 24 seven. Why not use it for good? Now on the Manifesti app, you could use the affirmation scheduler to write statements that affirm your manifestations. And just have it go throughout the day as your push notifications. Also do not forget to turn off other meaningless notifications that you don't really need in your life so that your phone becomes a positive reminder of your manifestations. Just imagine you're at work, you're going through a hard time and you really have to get something done. And imagine a notification pops up on your phone saying, I am lucky or I am a money magnet, or every day in every way, I am getting better. Immediately, your brain changes. Immediately, you feel better, you feel positive. Affirmations play a huge role when it comes to manifesting. Take your phone right now or after the video and get notifications that are basically affirmations. Because I know y'all read notifications, all right? I know y'all do. Why not use it for good? Number four, make sure to not put your goals on a pedestal. Fix your language, fine tune your language. If you hope and wish, you're basically vibrating that there's a gap between you and your manifestations. If you think that this goal is huge or it would change every single thing in your life, there is a vibrational gap. You should normalize your goals. Start to imagine having it and practice the feeling of having it but make it normal and average on how it feels because the moment you put something on a pedestal that is the moment it looks down on you so do not think of the moment you first get it but instead think of it as if you already had it for a long time this is a more real vibration and emotion of having your future you should feel more like of course i have it i mean i'm that girl of course i i get whatever i want so Obviously, I have it. That is the kind of attitude you need to have. Number five, keep your mind positive and be patient. The mind can get very pessimistic and negative. It is designed to focus on the negative. It just helps us survive. But try to catch yourself when you fall into this way of thinking. You gotta stay grateful and expect that your wishes come true. And you can do this by practicing as if you already have what you're trying to manifest. Remember that manifesting is always done in the present moment. So from moment to moment, ask yourself, what am I attracting now? And check in with your thoughts and feelings in the moment. And remember you guys, you attract what you are, not what you want. So the state of your being is super important. Now, something that really helps me with this is meditation. Now you can use the meditate section in Manifesti to practice visualization meditations and to calm your mind down so it naturally stays optimistic and present. Now the 22 minute mind swim meditation is one of my favorites on the Manifesti app. It is amazing for your mental health. It is great for lowering your anxiety, helps you reduce attachment, and it just makes the mind more present and naturally grateful. And it is great when you actually practice it every single morning obviously before you start your day that is the best time to manifest whatever you want as soon as you wake up that is what I do as soon as I wake up I'm meditating you will never catch me wake up and doing something else the first thing I do is meditate I set my intentions for the day and I manifest whatever the hell I want to sometimes I even run out of things to manifest because I manifest so quickly number six be extra mindful of the content that you consume right before bed have you ever watched a scary movie and then you slept and you had a nightmare of that movie do you see the connection here now when you fall asleep the door to your subconscious mind opens up as your conscious mind becomes sleepy so this is the perfect time to plant some seeds so you might even find yourself dreaming of your manifestations so what I do is basically I look at my future feed before I go to bed. Now you could do the same thing by using the future feed on manifesting, but with images you would usually put on your vision board. Basically, it's like a scrollable board. So by scrolling, you get closer to your goals. So instead of scrolling through TikTok and Instagram and consuming random stuff that could give you all sorts of emotions, conflicting emotions, you could just scroll through your future board before you go to bed and manifest whatever you want. And number seven, the last one, which is also very important, just like the rest. You gotta make sure you match your mental with physical. You gotta take action. Don't just sit back and wait. You live in a physical reality. So go out there and take steps which will get you closer to your goal. Don't just sit around and wait because you will not 
manifest things like that. You gotta put in the effort. For example, if you wanna buy an apartment, go to open houses. If you want a car, go for a test drive. If you want a certain body type, start your fitness journey. You want new friends, go to social gatherings. Make it natural and embody the feeling of having it. So be confident, abundant, and magnetic. You know, practice makes perfect. So that was basically it for this video. I want y'all to comment down below your manifestation as if you already have it. So if you are trying to manifest your dream goal, I want you to comment it down below in the comment section as if you already have it, okay? And I want you to describe the feeling of having it. And I just wanna see if you guys are getting it. And I also want to help you guys manifest things even better. Also, you guys, I know that you guys are always on your phones, so, why not turn it into good? Download the Manifesti app because it just makes manifesting way more easier. Our phones and social media could be scattering to our thoughts and feelings sometimes, which then mixes up our manifestation signals. But with this app, you have all of these amazing tools that'll help you manifest things into your life anything. So, why not just download the app? This is a great app, I have been using it for months. I'm in love with it. Y'all know I don't recommend anything that I personally don't like. So when I tell you this app is great, so trust me on this. So obviously you can find the Manifesti app on both the App Store as well as the link in the description box below. Let me know how it goes for you. And yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And that is it for this video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.